Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to bring you the simple review of the Interphone app which enables you to operate with uh, this intercom without having to touch the device. It's very easy and very practical. First things you have to do is go check out the review that I'm going to leave up here or up here, I don't, rem I don't know which side, about the intercom and uh, once you've seen how, it's not that difficult to use the intercom to, to do the settings, but with the hub, everything will become much, much easier. Uh, for the first things we have to do, of course, connect the interphone with, the, with my phone, with, with Bluetooth. Then we have to go to the uh, Play Store. On the Play Store, we just have to uh, enter Interphone app, which I already have, so press Interphone app and then press Interphone, which is the first option there, you can see on the top and then, my, in my case I already have it installed it. in your case you just have to press install and then open once you press open it will connect Bluetooth disable, of course I have Bluetooth disable, I disable the Bluetooth I'm, I'm done, so I'm going to connect with the, with, the, with the interphone now. Okay, done. Retry. And at this moment, it is connected with the interphone. As you can see, uh, the first screen we have connect A, connect B. In case you have two units, I only have one. Either you have, can connect to one unit or the other, or you can connect to both units. So I'll just have one, there is no point. Again, second one, it's phone. We have redial. If I press redial, it's going to call the last number I called. Okay, it's, I'm in airplane mode. So it will call my uh, the last number, which in this case would be my house number. I've been doing some tests. If you do voice dial, you can uh, answer the phone with Google, Bixi, or any other application that recognizes voice. I'm going to cancel. And speed dial, it's almost the same as redial. Again, if you go to music, you press the play button and as you can see the music starts playing on my phone again it's a uh, forward and back buttons and you have share to A and share to B which is simply uh, either you can share it on this one or you can have the same music on both intercoms if you have the both of them again if you go to FEM which is the last option if you press enable, look, uh, the, mu the radio, the music is going to change and the radio, it is enabled. At this moment, I am listening to radio. Uh, we have a uh, next station, previous station, so let's change station. Here on the bottom, we have eight buttons, which I already have configured for uh, radio station. So if I press two, goes to another station. If I press seven, goes to another station. You can do an auto-tune, basically, it, if you press this button, it will, it will search the eight strongest stations uh, available and memorize them randomly on the, these eight slots available. If you, by instance, you, for instance, I want this station, which is 101.5, I want in slot number eight, I just press the slot number eight, and now it is memorized in that station. The last menu, it's the setting menus, it's quite simple. It tells you uh, the interphone version, it, tell, it gives you the volumes for everything, for uh, communicating, which is the intercom, it gives you the, the volume for the phone, it gives the volume for music, it gives you the volume for the FM. I'm listening to FM. look, if I put it down, I just shut down the music, if I put it up again, the music is back on. We have a guide, uh, which is uh, the GPS enables, it's the volume of the GPS. Voice answer, when you receive a call, you can, uh, you can uh, answer it by voice commands. FM RDS, it's the radio data, data search for the FM stations. Speed dial, it's already configured. Uh, auto volume, it is designed, it's configured for jet helmet, as you can see. This is a modular helmet, so it can work as a jet helmet, or you can do full-face helmet. So, 
and don't forget that also I have the proper jet mic installed. I do not have the full face helmet installed, uh, mic installed. And again, in guidance, English guide. So you have French, Italian, German, Spanish, Russian, Japanese, and other language that I don't see the point of them. And basically, this is how the app works. Uh, I really hope it is uh, it was helpful for you. And uh, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell, follow my other networks, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye!